It dropped my four four. It dry, it just keeps resetting my settings every time I start the game. Until I do that, do you want to do the two part notification? Why are you asking me, bro? Like it like you're not forcing me. That I mean, as I'm getting older, it really pisses me off, bro. Cause it's like you're just a smug asshole, man. Like, oh, do you do you want to? If I didn't want to, you're gonna ruin my game, bro. That right there, I feel I hate it. I hate it so much. And I find it in everything. I find it in cell phones. That's why I'm I'm not doing no cell phone. Here, here's a rule. No cell phone should be over $45 a month. In my world, in my life for the rest of my life. Check your you know, I'm, I'm done paying the $300 AT&T and Verizon bill. I'm just not going to do it, bro. I'm not going to do it. I'm just sick of doing it. I have the money. I've been doing it. I don't want to give you that money because I don't understand why it's so much. gonna give it to you bro i'm fucking sick of it i don't want to pay you any more money i don't want to pay anybody no more money and when my my car note is done for my f-150 i'm done with that i'm never doing a a car note again ever i'm never doing a car note again i i, I just don't want to give i just don't want i'm i'm i'm, I'm nauseated at giving people money bro i'm nauseated and when you find the peace to not give them money anymore, they agitate your peace because everything's online now. So I'm comfortably playing my game, not giving you any money. And you reset my two part notification thing to get me to see an advertisement. Or to, or, and if I don't feel like doing it that day, you reset all my settings that I work hard to get right. It's like that shit. I hate it, bro. I hate it so much. Oh, I hate it, bro. And I feel like I'm the only person that, that understands it. No one else gets what I'm hating. They don't get it. They just think, oh, you're being an asshole. I'm not being an asshole, dude. They're affecting your peace. That should be illegal. Peace. I mean, you, you go to jail if you go into a uh, public place and disturb the peace. Why do they get to do that? And I think that's the real problem with tech where, where the veneer is off. People are just sick of tech companies, bro. They're sick of it. Cause they they walk around like they can do anything they want. You know, that's how the cell phone companies feel. That's how these video games feel. But then the truth is, there's there's choice. I can just choose not to deal with you no more. All right, I don't want AT&T no more. I'm gonna go cricket. I'm gonna go visible. Oh, oh, this is how it's doing. Well, I'm gonna build me a PC that lasts ten years, and I'm gonna say screw the console. Yeah. You know, my boy Phil has a a, a, a a computer that still can run a game, and he built it in 2010. I need some of that love. Now he's fucking behind me. Use. All the all the campy ways you can get me, dude. You did nothing. You didn't even try, bro. Oh, he had a shotgun. He had the freaking one-hit shotgun. Watch. Yeah, chump. Hostile UAV. No, I mean, I love video games. I really do. You know, it's just that I don't think I love anything anymore to just Marking be the raped with the, the state of the economy, bro, and the state of jobs. It's like, I'm about to get killed. I know it. Enemy soldier incoming. Overhead. You know, it's just the state of the economy. I'm not trying to give you all of my money for for for, for the just the smallest stuff. Like like take the take the um the DLC pack from Modern Warfare 3 that they're trying to uh, push on us as a premium, according to the other guy's video. Yeah. You know, it, on one hand, you know, it's their right, it's their material to do whatever they want with. But at other times, it's just some stuff is just shitty, bro. If, if a company's garbage. Damn. 
if a company is just is just garbage and they're just doing little garbage stuff, I just don't want to give them my money anymore. And I think there is no console company that isn't garbage. That, you know, uh, uh, Xbox, PlayStation, they're all the same. They're super corporate businesses that just want a bunch of freaking money. I'm not saying PCs a uh, freaking the best thing in the world. I'm just saying that if there's a way for me to duck it, I want to. That that's what I'm saying. If there's if there's a way for me to duck your corporate greed just a little bit, I will. You made a Chomp. Damn. But no, um yeah, to me it's like <sighs> What else do the what else do these people want from us, man? I bought, I've got your game. I buy the, I guess I do the mini pet, mini buys, you know, buying blueprints or whatever, you know, you know, people do. I'm doing all, I'm doing all of that, and then it's like if I'm not doing enough of it, you have these small, real casino corporate ways of trying to extract more money out of me, and. To me, as you get older, this won't connect to a lot of younger people, probably. But uh, if you're at least mid twenties working age and you've got your check and lost it and got your check and had to give it away, and got your check, that stuff it really offends you, bro. It really offends you, dog. Whenever you get something and it breaks early, or 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 you lose you lose the proprietary charger and you, you basically have to buy a whole new device because there no one sells the proprietary charger on purpose. That's the feeling that I'm explaining. It's like, ugh. and it's like, I can play Warzone on my Xbox. I mean, on my computer, the computer I have already, but I can't do it. I mean, I can do it and stream. I can do everything from it. It just, it will look better with a second PC doing it. So I'm, I'm going to get my PC together, but it's like, I know someone's going to be like, well, you're doing the same thing with PC. That's true. But I just feel it a little less just from having this PC for three years and having not needing, not needing to upgrade it at all. And it just works. And I, you know, and if I did have to upgrade it, it would be a, a component inside of it. I wouldn't have to upgrade the whole thing. You know, I got another six years with this computer, six, seven. You know, and it's like, th that's where I'm trying to be. The cheaper way is the better way. As a guy says that I just started watching, he has a new YouTube. He says, the man with no bills is, is, is rich. And uh, you, you're not, you're not going to be able to live with no bills. But, I mean, that principle, you're trying to, you know, break things back down. And I'm not trying to give y'all a bunch of money, bro, for nothing. You know, it's already bad enough. I got to give you $70 to play uh, freaking zombies, man. It's just like, ugh. Oh, the worst, bro. My thought process is zombies better be good, bro. Zombies, let me tell you something. Zombies better be good. Because that Vanguard uh, uh, abomination, atrocity, honestly, it, it better be good, bro. I'm paying you, I'm paying you, actually I'm paying you $140 because my old lady wants it too. You know, so... My old lady wants it too. And um it just better be worth it, bro. And you think if I think about my whole little gaming friends, it's about five people. I mean, just add it up, dude. You're four hundred something bucks. Just if you know, if you have a four man crew, what how much money, bro? And it's like it's crazy because I feel like I just gave you Modern Warfare 2 and I didn't. It's been a while. And you know, I just and then then the the, the thirty dollars every month for the war zone enough. It's like, bro, this shit is getting expensive, man. It's getting expensive. I don't want to give you any more money just for you to agitate me throughout the the, the season for me to buy more loadouts. It's disgusting, and people like, "Oh, it's cheap." It is not cheaper. It's way more. I I was born in the in, in in the in the Nintendo era. You bought a cartridge, buddy. You were done.
You bought a cartridge, you were pretty much done, bro. Your eyes are closed to what's like really going on in, in, um, around you. And it's like, as you get older, you realize like, dude, I don't want to do that. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like, bro, I just, I just don't want to do it, bro. I don't want to, I don't want to do it. I, I give you a perfect example. I don't want to ever buy a new car. I bought a new F-150 maybe three years ago, three or four years ago. Call it five years ago. How many years ago was that? But anyway, I bought a, I bought a new F-150, uh, newish. It was like a, a year old, a year or two old. I paid $38,000 for it. I tried to get the most stripped down model I can get. The most stripped down model I could get was $38,000. Now that's like $60,000. So I, I really cannot complain, you know, really. But, um... After that, I pretty much, as I'm paying it, I was happy with the purchase in the beginning, but now it's like, I don't want to give y'all any more money. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just sick of it, bro. I'm sick of it. You know, once your car wears down, bro, once your, once your, once your car wears down, you know what I'm saying? Once it wears down and it's not even wears down, once you get used to it. You don't want to give anybody no money, bro. It's like, you see this car every day. Why am I just, you're just giving this entity $500. And I just don't want to give them any more money. I just don't want to. I'm going to, but I don't want to. So <laughs> now it's like, if I could ever, when I'm free of this uh, payment, which will be soon, I'm never doing it again, dog. I now have respect for the guy who pulls up in the old Tacoma, bro. I give, I give my hat off to that guy, guy. It's usually an old white guy. It is what it is at the job, if you're at your job. And, I mean, he has, like, let's say it's 2023 now. He is rocking the piss out of that 2005 Oak uh, 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 Tacoma, bro. With the little rust spots around the door. He is pumping that baby and he's not giving it up. And you may think, well, I got the brand new Raptor. Dude, you're an idiot. You're an idiot, bro. He's just driving that sucker back and forth to work for banging it. Four, four cylinder. He's okay on gas. It has four wheel drive. He can drive through the snow. Everything. He got a bed. He can put stuff in it, move stuff. He's fine, bro. And he's just, that means he has gotten to the point where he has disconnected from the, 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 the money or, or the, or not money, the materialism enough to say, I'm good. I don't need no car. And he's, he's, that's, that's the spirit I'm trying to live in, bro. I'm not trying to be just giving you cars just because I'm just not trying to just give you five years of my life. Because when you sell, when you buy a car, you're selling a percentage of your life. Five years is a long time. No one thinks about the ama amount of humans that only live five years. No one thinks about that. And it's a no for me, bro. It's a no for me. They'll never get me again. They'll never get me again, dude. I will drive jalopies, bro. You know, my F-150 has another, what, five years before it's considered a jalopy? I'll drive jalopies.